and old reset. And you know what, actually, something I do want to point out, actually, from both the last set that they played, with, like, you know, Luis playing Rob, and also what I'm seeing right now, uh, Luis, his policy has actually been almost entirely below his opponent, actually. Compared to, like, Rob, where he was constantly going above his opponent a lot, and, like, having to recover high a lot of the times, like, very, very high even, like, Luis has been doing a lot better at maintaining the vertical, you know, positioning, but as soon as I say that, Rune has tried, finally been popping Luis up in the air, but I feel like this is the first game where Luis has properly been, like, you know, in a vertical disadvantage. Oh, no. no. Oh, my goodness, and speaking of verticality, sending you straight to the moon. Yeah, and, and, it, and that... This was really a, a story of like Varun was in advantage for so long, and he he had a bunch of a bunch of opportunities to like get it, get a final hit, get the stock, but Ooh. he didn't quite get it. And Luis gets one read, ends the stock off super quickly, and now uh, now Two socks gets that uh, yeah gets gets that starter that he loves, the Nair. Ooh, actually. He was probably expecting the Nair to send him off stage, but unfortunately the Nair has sent him towards the stage instead. Varun was not quite able to capitalize. Now both players are kind of just scrambling, pressing what buttons they could. Luis with some very optimal shield plays, placements to punish a lot of those grounded side bees. Not going to punish him that time though. Yeah, he's trying to go for an smash with a little bit of an aggressive read. Nair drag down into back throw, trying to set up a ledge guard. Uh oh, careful. Uh, a ledge trap, but yeah, Ooh. that up smash is going to be one way to beat out that side beat ledge. He's been going for the down tilt. That hasn't been working, but this up smash was in time. Two stocks taken with up smash already this game. Wow. As oh, Luis through the food, Alice. And honestly, like that is that is you know actually every single KO in this game has been vertical, like a star KO, which is actually pretty amazing. Oh, uh, I think that is the first time yeah, we're finally gonna see a KO. Yeah, What's, it's, it's quarter it's counted. Three. Yeah, it's the three three point twenty five. Yeah. <laughs> But honestly, I'm actually kind of impressed that like Varun has been, you know, having his bandana keep it a surprising amount of pace in this game. He has his offense has not been discouraged, even though Luis has been placing some really good shields. He's not stopping his aggression. His side beats are still going at it, and he's trying to draw attacks wherever he sees fit. And a lot of them have been sticking. Now he just needs to find ways to properly KO and you know get these stock advantages. Because right now he's attacking on a lot of percent, but a lot of his KOs have been kind of around, you know, 100 percent He went for it, he went for the air dodge read, was trying. Trying yeah, to you see the smirk on his fall. face. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> he's like, like, I ain't gonna fall for that. What do, what, what do you think I am, man? Yeah, Varun also with the smirk, just kind of like, yeah, I try yeah. to get you on that one. <laughs> you, you, you do. <laughs> no, nah, we love, we love it out here, though. Oh my goodness, the grand finals has not been boring, anyways. And I hope you guys on Twitch are entertained as well, watching as we commentate you through this grand final. Yeah, shout it's out to everybody cool. who tunes in every Wednesday, uh, even if you aren't in the area. If you are in the area. Just checking out something because you couldn't go. Love to see you here. Love to have you in chat. Love to love to have you support this venue, and it's a oh. it's a great place. It's a great place to go. Before we get into our next game, it looks yeah. like we're actually doing a quick button or controls check, or maybe they might just want to be playing with a different uh, control scheme. It actually could be one of these. Uh, I I would predict maybe Varun playing a different character. Actually, might be Peach. Might be Peach or True. Daisy. Yeah, he watch does play Peach Nova Daisy. Scotia? Dang. I actually almost... Ooh, watch from Nova Scotia. Wow. Shout out, to, shout out to... I don't even know where that is on the map. I've taken so many geometry classes. Geometry? <laughs> geometry. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's in Canada. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's in Canada, but, but I I'm might be wrong. I'm a commentator, I swear. <laughs> <laughs> I know I'm, I'm, I'm a commentator, not a, not a geographer. <laughs> but yeah, Absolutely. hey, thanks for, thanks for tuning in. I appreciate Absolutely. you. Nah, we'd love to have you here. All of my improper geologists aside, let's go straight into this game yep. number two. Ah, called it. <laughs> called that shit. Yeah. yeah. It's the peach. The peach. Okay, so I actually... The peach is nuts. Yes. That, that, this was actually the first character that I've seen Rune play. And actually, it was a tournament. That yep. Wi-Fi tournament. That faded Wi-Fi tournament in 2020. You know, when yep. I first saw this man in action. And man, this guy kicks some serious ass. You gotta be so careful because this peach is optimal city. He yeah, got combos for days. He got fair. resets. He got everything. Maybe not quite a positioning, but we'll get there. I haven't seen him do the zero to death, but yeah. you know that's that's asking a lot yeah, for absolutely. for a secondary. Even even from a from a beach main, the zero to deaths are quite. Yeah. Uh oh, careful though, you're out of a float. Yeah, you're out of the jump is, uh, as well. This is dangerous. He's gonna have to early up B. Yeah, yep, again gets exactly. hit by side B early and goes for the second one. Wow. Finally able to get out of the corner with a get up attack as. As Luis kept pressuring him. Oh man, it you know, feels so bad against Palatina, where you're, where you're, where you're able to, you know, like you're able to win neutral a couple times, and then she puts you off stage, and you're like, oh, I just took 80% exactly for being off stage one time. 
No, that was literally what I was about to say. It's just like, man, Vroom, I could have sworn Vroom was at least at like 1722 earlier, right? Yep. And now here he's at 102. Luis, literally by just having Vroom off stage that entire time, has eaten up this game percent wise. Yeah, and down tilt, not gonna confirm in anything of this percent. Yeah, what do you even confirm to as Pikachu? I have Palutena 138 percent. You know, nice, nice cancel by the way. Luis, you're sick. Yeah. Of <laughs> yeah, but like, I mean, you're, you're in Palutena, you gotta have those. Absolutely. Yeah, right now things are going to be looking kind of rough for Rune. Finally gets off stage, is able to get back with a getup attack, and now the Jazz is going to be setting him at an awkward angle, but no proper punish. The explosive flame covers him long enough to just run a dash attack, and Rune looking like a deer in the headlights. Wasn't really quite sure what to do in that scenario. Yeah, he, yeah, he tried to go for a float fair, but he needed to do something a little bit uh, a little bit uh, uh, just of range. Yeah. No, you can't punish it out of shield. No, no, I'm just saying like sh they just hold shield rather oh, at that point. Yeah. yeah. Sorry. Oh, oh it, yeah, it does nice. get some does get some nice combos here. Forty one percent off of the uh, the turn up on the ledge, but yeah, just covering his re return to stage with these explosive flames super well. Luis is uh, Luis is doing a really good job getting out of disadvantage here. Every time, every time, uh, every time he gets put in it, it's a it's a dangerous game because he might get reversal. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, and honestly, Peach reversals are very scary as well because you know Peach has a lot of really strong edge guardian tools. And ever since melee, she's always had them, of course. Yeah. But, that means but I mean, it's harder to, it's, it's much harder for her to edgeguard teleports. We've seen yeah. Rune doing the float, trying to get the Nair timed, time for Luis's recovery, but Luis has avoided every single time, and now, side B, and just be able to air dodge back to ledge, and get up attack again. It seems like he's got, he's hit four or five get up attacks already, and just this, this first two stocks, and just punishing that. Yeah, okay, Ooh. explosive flame, but once again... Oh, he tried to go for the air dodge, read. That was, I see you, Luis. <laughs> yeah, Definitely and, that, and that's, that's a scary... It's a scary thing because obviously, you know, if, if he gets hit by that explosive flame, he's gonna die. But on the other, the other hand, if he goes left and doesn't get doesn't get hit by the explosive flame, that's a free punish, and he probably is killing Luis with a forward air or something like that. But he was so scared, he, he double jumped instead. So Luis, just oh man, keeping a yeah. And I guarantee you, like eighty percent so of the pressure. I guarantee that like eighty percent of the guild house players would have fallen for that as well, right? Where they yeah. would have air dodge left and gotten like you know frag trap, or they would have air dodge right right into the explosive flame. But you know, first days. Oh, sorry, I say Varun. Sorry, I'm looking at chat, but Varun, Varun, uh, definitely plays Luis for how many games? You know, we've already talked about on the sixty stream, sets. Like, 60, 60, this is their sixty second set. Sixty second? Oh my goodness, you're right. Yeah, because there's three sets today. Jeez, man. First days here in his name immediately throws out the emo. <laughs> Yo, what's up, first days? <laughs> Okay, try to play some turn up, try to play neutral. Oh my god, that dash attack's so good. The fact that he just plays some turn up is insane. But you're just gonna have to let it rock right now. But unfortunately, it might be for the worst on Varun's end because. Oh, you're done. Oh, you're super dead. Yep. You can't be hanging out there with a Paracel. Oh. Luis is gonna catch that every time. Anyone know if Repo entered? Uh, you can check out the bracket at smash.gg slash guildhouse if you want to take a look at it, but I do not know who Repo is. Yeah. So I'm, I'm assuming they didn't enter. Do we have a chat command for a like exclamation point bracket actually? Or probably. We probably yeah. have an exclamation mark bracket. Yeah. So, like if that works as well, then you can also do that. Just take a look at it, get directed. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Perfect. Yeah, we can't see links, I think, uh, okay. with the view of chat we have. Gotcha. So gotcha. If people okay. if people have Yeah, yeah. Three, Thank you, production. <laughs> Thanks, production. One, Absolutely. Go! Man. Honestly, okay, so we're going in game number three. I believe that they have played on Pokemon Stadium 2 every single time this Grand Finals. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm pretty sure I've seen this background every single time. I believe it has been all PS2 all the time. That's how you know that they just want to go. PlayStation 2. <laughs> Absolutely, yeah. PS2. Great, great uh, console. God. Yeah, nice nice combo. Was going for a little bit oh. more with the up air into the turn up throw toss, but didn't get it. <laughs> Yeah, they're looking, looking like they play some, you know, old old school baseball catch right there. <laughs> you know, just tossing it sort of back and forth between one another. That being said, Rune finally has Luis off stage. Oh my goodness, that teleport again is so cool. Yeah, it's just like you were saying earlier, actually, in the like, last game. You know, that alternate teleport is so tricky for Peach to, uh, you know, properly punish if she is in the middle of floating because her move speed is reduced compared to her ground speed. Yeah, and it's... Oh, nice, uh, nice oh stage. Oh my the explosive flame and Yeah, we're gonna die to that. Um, catch is so good. Oh my goodness, you're so sick. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, cal calm down. It's just, yeah. <laughs> it's just a warm guess. He does it every time. <laughs> yeah, I mean, like, I know, I, I know I'm making fun of him for it, but honestly, I'm actually a little bit impressed every single time I see Paul's hands do it, because it yep. is still execution, at least for me. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> it's, it's, it's something that, that you do, uh, 
you start off doing it like, you know, just spamming tech between stocks, but once you start incorporating into your gameplay, that's when yeah. I think it becomes a lot better. I, I oh, know yeah. a lot of people use it too um, for positioning, some people use it for, for stalling out, like, inv invincibility, stuff like that. Yeah. It's something you Luis uses it a lot for, so it's it pretty is nice. Great. Yeah, and it's, it is always just fun to see, actually. Like, Luis, in general, both, like, his movement and his tracking have just been absolute top notch this entire series, right? Oh. He has been tracking through like a homing missile right now. He's yeah, and not everything. even falling for that, uh, that counter that Varun has gotten him with before. Yeah. You get one you get one of those is basically all Luis lets you have. And yeah. Luis just wow, oh, such yeah. good spacing in this corner. Oh, oh, oh. But Varun's finally able to hit him with a jab. Not gonna connect not gonna connect oh. with all of these aerials. I'm... So many aerials, but Luis finally just Ooh. finds a grab and all that pressure for not as Luis goes Man. up one, I one stock that. on this final game possibly of this true finals. Gosh. Is Varun gonna be able to take this one or no? Gosh, I love that turn of mix up pressure as well. The fact that he was able to just re grab and go for the shield pressure. But that being said, Varun, he does have a uh, Polite and a percent. The more one straight forward air. Okay, not quite gonna be it. Then make it louder for me, but <laughs> next, one, next one, one, one more straight forward air is gonna absolutely be sealing it. But that being said, we might not get a chance to see it. Oh, that does get the job done. Rage is so good. Oh, and oh, Varun oh. is gonna fall as Luis takes this tournament, this guild house is secure as Luis wins another one. And unfortunately for Rune, he wasn't able to get a single game off of that Palutena. But uh, yeah, that's going to be it here for us. Uh, congratulations to Luis. Everybody, Louis uh, money. yeah, Luis money. Everybody, <laughs> make sure to sign up for Rise of Guildhouse on uh, on Sunday. Check that out. Smash.gg slash Rise of Guildhouse. Oh, yes. Uh, awesome, awesome venue that we have right here in front of us. And yeah, it's gonna be an amazing time. Uh, make sure, make sure everyone to uh, to check that out. Watch the stream if you're not gonna.